I was to ask you to describe your dream stool, what would its ideal consistency, appearance, colour, texture be? How much time do we have? Because I could go on for a while here. <laughs> I, I, I could listen for a long time. I think I'll keep it. I think I'll keep it very straightforward and say that the ideal stool is soft but formed. I would describe it like a sausage. All right, so it's not hard. It's not lumpy, bumpy. It has a shape. It's not a pile of mush, um, but it's soft but formed like a sausage. And it's a complete release, a complete evacuation, filling the toilet. Is color important? Generally, it's going to be brown. Generally, it's going to be brown. There are some unique situations where color can be changed. You know, for example, if you go in and drink a uh, 16 ounce of beet juice, you're going to notice your stool turns red and you're going to worry that you're bleeding. But that's the beet juice. We've all been there. But in terms of light or dark brown, does that make any difference? Not really. It's the bile that is causing the color to be the way that it is. So, for example, if someone gets their liver blocked with a gallstone, you stop seeing colored stools that are brown. You start seeing clay colored like very pale okay so one good test is do the probiotics make you produce more of a sausage like evacuation well i think when you notice that kind of difference whether it's a probiotic or a prebiotic that to me is indicative of yes you are noticing a positive change mm -hmm.